Adrian, you're having an interview now to explain why you managed to score 100 yeah. on your 50 metres. Yeah. Would you like to would, would you like to tell us how that felt? Oh, I, it was coming to the end of that shoot and I was getting close to the 100 mark and I was having difficulty triangulating my position. And there, there was another pinnacle to it, I always felt like a spinning top. But it, you must have felt absolutely elated scoring your first 100 I did. in competition. Well, I, I looked through last night and I saw that I had got it. I, oh dear, I couldn't stand up for 10 minutes. And the rest of your teammates, well, they were all over you, weren't they? Like a hot rash. Absolutely. <laughs> like a sticky toffee on a sticky toffee pudding. But then everything seemed to go wrong. Well, <laughs> you see, you see, it's a tale of two halves. Just tale of two halves. Would you like to tell us what happened in the 100? I couldn't see the diddly squat. I see, diddly squat. I felt like a mole yes. in the sunshine. And out of the 40 shots that you had to shoot at the target, yeah. how many of them actually hit the target? <laughs> Three. Three? <laughs> but I couldn't see where they were landing. I see. Um, why do you think it was like that everybody else yeah. on the detail could yeah. see where their shots were going? Well, I don't you think this is a fairly lame excuse? There's two, there's two folds to this. It's the first fold is the fact that I perhaps have got a cheap and nasty scope. Ah. eBay sticks me up like a good one. I think. But you've not <laughs> second, complained about second, this before. The second excuse is, in fact, the major one is that my target was on the very left. See? Oh. So, so it was in the shade of the orchard trees, oh. and you couldn't see, it was like looking into a cave trying to find the bear it was, <laughs> honest, you couldn't see, you couldn't see. Have you got anything to say to your partner? Oh I am very sorry John, I'll have to buy you another drink, a ah, hundred! <laughs> Thank you very much for the interview, Adrian. Goodbye. Don't worry, Jonathan. Love you. Bye. Bye.